have signs that are going up on all the trails that are approximately a quarter mile apart. There's two types of signs that they'll see. There's aluminum signs that are uh, a, a square or a rectangle, and then we have car snipe signs that are like the breakaway signs along the Silver Comet Trail and other places where uh, bicyclists or runners may run into them. What you need to know is these are about a quarter mile apart. There's an eight digit number on there that when you call 911, you give that location. It doesn't just show up as a place on a trail. It actually shows up like a home address or a business address, and it puts it on the responder's map on their computer, just like it would my house or your house. So that enables the first responder not only to know exactly where to go on the road, but they can find it and look up the address and drive right to it. Going from Smyrna all the way down into Paulding County, that's a long stretch of road. You get out there, you're listening to music, and you're not really paying attention. You go down, you're not necessarily going to know where you are. So when you see that marker, even if it's not you or somebody comes up on you and they're able to get to that marker, it's going to save so much time and you'll have so much confidence in your experience because the police will be there so much faster. If it's not directly on the road or accessible, there's going to be notes embedded into that call that tell the officer, park here, walk down the trail, turn right, and it'll take you to that location marker. So it's going to enhance the response time for fire, uh, police department, and the ambulance service dramatically. We're going to find for people who need help a lot faster now. We've had officers and firefighters that have had to walk up to two miles carrying someone on a stretcher, and that was just a wake-up call for us that this was desperately needed. Thank you.